Have cases of cognitive decline more than doubled over the past decade? Well, let's take a look. That in a report at Study Finds. Be sure to like and subscribe below. Everyone forgets where they left their keys every once in a while, but research suggests that forgetting things will be just the beginning of problems for many. No, I'm not saying losing your keys is a sign, but man, there, there are times I walk into a room and I wonder what the hell was I even going in there for? Hope that's not a sign. Okay, what now? Oh, new research from England finds the number of cases of cognitive decline more than doubled in 10 years, increasing the likelihood of dementia. For the study, researchers used data from more than 1.3 million people between the ages of 65 and 99, taken between 2009 and the end of 2018. More than 50,000 participants went to their doctor with concerns of memory loss. Nearly 15,000 experienced cognitive decline. Now, while memory concerns remain stable, concerns of cognitive decline doubled between 2009 and 2018. For every 1,000 people who were under observation for possible cognitive issues, there was one new case of cognitive decline. By the end of 2018, there were three new cases of cognitive decline for every 1,000 people. Within three years of follow-up with a person who reported memory problems, 46% went on to develop dementia. Of those who experienced cognitive decline, about 52% later had a dementia diagnosis. I don't mean to bring the room down here, but I think the point is start early and often with your doc and see if there's anything that you can do to keep this nasty beast away from your brain. There's diet, there's changes in sleep, there's all kinds of things. One study limitation was the different ways doctors reported memory concerns and cognitive decline. They say more research is definitely needed to look at how many older adults report symptoms of cognitive decline in the general population than just those in primary care. Now, we have a bunch more information on this. We have all kinds of studies on memory and dementia and Alzheimer's disease. Lots of good reading out there. Head to studyfinds.com if you go to the description in this video and click on the link. You can get all kinds of information there. Thanks for stopping by studyfinds.com.